Hi, YouTube. Good to see you, whoever you are, wherever you are. Today is another review. Today is a review of previous lessons. Lesson 178 is a review of lessons 165 and 166. Lesson 165, let not my mind deny the thought of God. And lesson 166, I am entrusted with the gifts of God. But first of all, the mantra, ongoing. God is but love and therefore so am I. Anything that is not of love, anything that is seemingly of separation, division, disunity, disharmony, discord, anger, resentment, pain, fear, anything that causes separation from me and my brother, the people that we are together, the people that we are, united in one, not actually people, but expressions of the divine. Anything that is in the way of that is not love, and therefore is not God, and therefore is not ultimately real, and not my true home, your true home, the true home, from which this seeming world emerged, and it is exactly that, a seeming world, not my true home. As beautiful as it could be, and I'm here in the jungle in Tulum, and the sun has set, but it looks gorgeous to these eyes. But it is simply a, a bad copy of prime reality, as I've heard said before. Which doesn't mean I can't enjoy it while I'm here. Lesson 165 then review let not my mind deny the thought of God this world will attempt to distract me this world will attempt to draw my attention into it to be a proclaimer of its reality because that is where its fuel comes from the more people believe that it is real the stronger its seeming reality becomes and in the midst of all that let not my mind deny the thought of God, the memory of my original home, the memory of the place that I come from and which I am destined to return to. Let not my mind forget that. Let not my mind deny that. Let not my mind continue on this journey of separation. There's always two choices, love and fear unity or separation let me choose unity on that ultimate level the way it plays out on the screen of the world is how it plays out the script is written but at that ultimate level let not my mind exist in that denial that causes me such internal conflict that causes me the feeling of separation that causes me to fear, to hate, to be angry towards. Let me remember what is true. And lesson 166, I am entrusted with the gifts of God. I'm trusted to carry these gifts forward. And every moment, every holy instant, as the Course calls it, that I am here, present and connected to the true divinity that binds us all. I am bringing forth those gifts into this world. Will it transform the way the world seems to be? None of my business, but it will transform the internal experience that moves through this vessel. And so the screen of reality, seeming reality will likely change. But it doesn't matter. At that point, peace has returned. And when peace has returned, there is so much less need for any of the chaos and drama that can become so addictive. The truth is that on this little me level, I'm addicted to the drama of this world. I'm addicted to the little me Duncan story that I appear to be living out. I'm addicted to the division and the pain and the suffering. And when I'm 
embrace the wholeness of my true home. I remember that this is just a, a silly dream. It does not need to be taken seriously. It does not need to take up all my time and all my attention. It does not need, it does not need to continue any longer. This course saves me time and gives me the chance to have a different experience. I love you all so much. Subscribe to the videos if you've not already done so and I will be back here very, very soon.